want to Abraham's business show. I'm Tudu Abraham by name, and here with me is Mr. and Mrs. David Ede. It's a pleasure to have you around. Um, we are here again, and today's goal seems to be exciting and entertaining. Sir, what attracted me to your family is your youth. I wouldn't want to guess your age. Um, if you don't mind, can you kindly tell us how old you are and the age you were before you got married? Yeah, I am 29 years old, sir. Okay. Madam? 27. 27 years. How old are you when you got married? I think I'm 26, 27. Okay. And Madam? At what age? I got married. I think he was 27. Then I got married on my birthday. My birthday. That's awesome. What would be the age you'll be when you got married? Were you in any serious relationship before then? Ma? No. How about you, sir? I wasn't. I didn't just become young. I wasn't in any relationship that she defined She said she was in hostel. And uh, at the age of 27, how financially going under you to have taken such a bold step and decision? I I actually have money. So far as I see, I have any special money in my account when I met her. I met her actually in school. And uh, I was actually in school. You went to school to go and study at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> I was at my 400 level then. When I invested back in Portugal, Macaulay. So when I met her, and I saw that she was the kind of person I have the same kind of mindset I had, I went with the mentality of not going to marry her. I just went with the mentality of let me be friend because of the kind of person I met her that, he, that she is. A friend of mine actually sent somebody from Tupo, a female, and this is one of the sister, a female, yes. to come and uh, take a position here at um, Texas University. And this person has not been to Benet before. Has not been to Benet before. And because of trust, this person, I think we knew each other from uh, Tupo before, he brought the sister to come and stay with me in my house till the following day. And I. You know, if you are if you have been to India before, we have made our female stays and for our stay, and it's not possible for a a female to come and stay in a, 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 a guy's hostel. It's not yeah. possible that I don't know that school, so it's not possible in that So I had to call one of our fellowship sister at the FCS that I'm bringing somebody to come and stay with you. The person is coming from school. So when the person now arrived at the park, taking bus to Bego to Macaulay. She coincidentally met my wife, then that is in the Then coincidentally entered the same taxi from the park again to SRS Junction where you enter under the keke to school. Coincidentally enter under the same keke. So at this time they have met to the like repeatedly from Otupo, like three different vehicles. Yeah. They have met it there plenty times. And it was actually raining, heavily raining that day. So she not took the game because the network was bad. I was able to communicate with her and she has not been to my colleague before. The person that is coming to was coming to stay with me. To stay with my fellowship sister rather. So she not took this particular girl to her house. Without knowing you, without knowing, knowing the her person. Of yeah. She took the girl to her house, took care of her. In fact, she was already drenched uh, by rain. So she gave her shelter, gave her everything. Gave her a wrapper, made noodles for her, and you know, when the rain has subsided and the network and issue was now better. So I was able to communicate with her. Oh, Justina, where are you? She said she is with one of she at one hotel, sir, at one hostel in this one. I said, Who's posted that? What do you know in that Greek? See, uh, it was one girl that picked her and took her back. I said, ah. So I now have to go and uh, I think I need to go. When I, I got that side, I said, okay, get your things, let me go and hand over you to the sister I called. And I was thinking I have to come and stay with you. 
So okay, it's not just good for me to take you like that. That particular person that helped you, I think I need to appreciate that. I think that is how we get. Probably before then, I don't have any body as friends about the culture. In fact, my friend used to tell me that, are you sure you can get married? And so that is how I was able to meet her. And when I met her, I told her plainly that I am not trying to use as a privilege, but because you're a good man, because I don't believe that all person can exist. And to me, to the extent I have such kind of mind, I can help somebody without a person to So, for all the other kind of mindsets, I think, I think from then, I started giving you my things, there are some courses that uh, you, know, you want to generally do, some courses in common. I didn't answer that because... You were 400 level then, and yeah, she was 100 level. level. Yes. Okay. I didn't give you some materials that um, we can we, we use to do in common in one and other department. Engineering and other department rather right? used to do in common. I didn't give you some materials with that no intention. So gradually, gradually, I realized that is how we started. <laughs> I think uh, your good deed has already paid in full. Okay. It's good to be good. If not for your kind heart and the action you took, your past would have met each other. You guys are destined to meet, and that's the way you're going to have a program in your life. Your testimony is awesome, and I believe the youth out there will have a whole lot to learn from this. That age that you got married, what were your parents' reactions? Were there any objections or reservations to that at that age? Actually, to the school, yeah. and there was nothing doing per se. We just had a little shop where we managed at that time. So, in school, in school, that's what I'm with somebody. So, my elder ones were not really supporting, support of it. They were like, when will you get the money for wedding? Round up the school, that's the advice I round up the school. And the, the money they were even charging at school was not for the bright price. Yes, you know, the, for the tradition, and now you have to sell to them. You know, so the money was like, uh, it wasn't forthcoming and all this stuff. So there was a lot of rejection, but God was faithful. With all the restrictions from your family and from I mean its own financial strength and buoyancy there, what pushed you? What gave you the conviction that you push you continue despite the restriction from your family, you still went with him and it all ended as of you ended as husband or wife? Yes. 
I mean, you know, scared, be happy, even though you're not married to her. What if you change her mind? I have this kind of confidence. Even before I, apart from the fee self, I've even done some crazy things. Uh, opening my company bank account as a name of, uh, 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 using her as my name of king. Before, like, before getting married. Before even getting married. What gave you that conviction? Why are you so sure? Because I knew, I, you know, when you know something, you know that you know it. I knew and I was sure that this is the kind of person I want. When I met her, but she was not the other guests are coming. You know, so you, 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 you have a guy now. I want to go and let's go for, 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 for this e trade today. Let's go and buy this. She has never requested for one thing. That, that she was the one adding to me. Adding, but sometimes she could bring her full stuff. Come and give it to me because no guests now they don't like it. Saying, no more, just this petty petty, not like anything, no more food. So when they give us some food stuff, we just bring all of them to me. Oh, and so this kind of and there's one crazy thing she even did self during a year one when I met her. She had two Android phones then, and I, I, I think I was using flush like phone. We just barely met somebody, not up to three days. And when she wanted to go for the want to go for the exam. She brought her the phone that she came for her. Eh? Don't even know you whether oh, this place, you have not even met this place apart from that one that I met at the We have not even met again. And she had this kind of thing. For you, that kind of trust, I will give you my trust. Can I say yours is love at first sight? <laughs> Am I right or wrong? Ma. We didn't really start, we started as friends. Not I don't think you even asked me out like officially. From friendship, friendship is between just continued like that till when we asked. How long did it take or call for you? I think for like uh, four years. Wow. Because if it were me, I would have been married her when she was even to be true. But it was not for the call. At that point, you that you got married, just how brilliant were you? Because she said earlier that her family were not supportive, but they, 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 they believed they gave you from home to, to perform the traditional rites. You were not brilliant enough to, to settle it. So, how come? We want to know. The viewers are the ones to know that they can learn from you. So, if there's any mistake, I think whatever your testimony is going to be a source of encouragement and inspiration to those out there. You know, what I did was that I believe that in everything you are doing, planning is. One of the major things that should be involved. So, what I started doing is that I got everything I wanted to do. Went to uh, event planners and we got from the templates from there and this from there. I hope so you are not doing those pre preparations with faith. You had it for it was It, it, it was with faith, we were doing all these things. It was with faith, we were doing all these things. All those things were with faith. So, when I got it, if I have 1,000, then I'm going to buy a pack of drink, plastic drink. I'll check the expiring dates and Why are you ready for this preparation? Have you got some approval from my parents already? I haven't. But I, 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 I was just sure that the only thing that is like, if they see everything, I'm going to let people know. Before then, they have already, you know. Okay, we, without wasting so much time, and we want to round up who this video is so long as they the initial time when you came for her, there were these rejections. Mm -hmm. Now, how has it been? Have you been fully accepted in the family? I'm fully accepted. Fully accepted. I hope you're not the best meal that they've had now. Fully accepted. I'm one of the best. <laughs> <laughs> in, fact, <laughs> in fact, one of the siblings even called that. Wow. The mom is even praying for us no more than. You like, were saying that from your own self, because you're not buoyant and all that, you're not accepted then. Now, have you been fully accepted in the family? Fully accepted. Now. Now I hope you're not the best meal of <laughs> so far. <laughs> As I said, one of the best. Wow. Mom pray for me like every day. Wow. So the best that the sibling called that. Uh, am I part of the, you know, family? The mother will be calling my name always in the place of prayer. Wow. And, um, because we are doing what the Bible has instructed. We will be our parents, even down to financial. Here's how a mom study and whenever she is on our good parents. Wow. And whenever she, from the little we are in it, 
and whenever she is meet, it's much her best to see what comes back with this. Wow, do you think your husband actually has been accepted to your family? Just for what he just said. What makes you think so? How many elder ones do you have that are married sisters? Six elder sisters. Wow. Yes. And my mom has never gone for yes. <laughs> my mom has never gone for any of them. Wow. When I gave birth to my first daughter, Deborah, yeah. my mom actually came. Are you the last daughter? No. And what's I mean, is that the reason why you felt you are he is the best in love in the family? I felt my sister had to worry because those ones have they got mom got married, I was still in secondary school, but my mom has never gone there. Mr. Dave, I think we need to start with this race. Uh, <laughs> it's actually so, divine. For then, her to even come here. Uh, it shows that. I normally call her, I normally call her now for me, David. Wow. Like, and your husband's name is David. David. He's the one I'm calling her for David. Because once she calls him, Sarah is my son. Oh my god. I don't call her for David. I think he's really lovely and interesting. If you have a very good rapport with your mother, I know, and father, it doesn't matter how bad it is. So I was asking you a question if I address a little. Prior to your preparation for the marriage, you had nothing. So, how were you able to cope to join one and two together to make the wedding a reality? As I was trying to explain before, yeah. When we are doing making preparation, she once in a while she used to come to my business place to come and business she she actually found it. Okay. But since she was in school, I mean I just stepped out of school. She found the business. Business, yes. And you continue you manage it for her. Yes, she's the founder of the business. Wow. So we just started, I think we started with about 1,500 there. Wow. And this is the business we are trying to more profit from it and you know gardens for some money you have one thousand you can buy one plastic or one pack of last gym in preparation for the marriage to make sure that we check the expiring date so that doesn't exceed the date we are fixed in our mind but so, okay. <laughs> so that is how we're able to buy one one pack fit at work but the movie yeah. I watched some time ago they said fit like potatoes yes but if you buy that movie maybe you go and look for it we bought one one pack we're able to buy 400 pieces of one at each time. When one 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 come, you get one until one you got the other piece. Yeah, that is uh, uh, that we will be able to get four hundred pieces. That's about forty pack, right? Yeah. Because yeah. that way gets to be expected. Yes, the four hundred yes. So the same thing we did for Maggie, one thousand five over one hundred. That's how we did for all. Anybody we have at that point. Even if you can go and get something for our job. Wow. That's how we did for wine, we did for and everything was set. So we just went left for to buy cow and all that is the same method we did and God was with I felt God actually saw the heart. Yes. And he he, he he actually saw your heart and you were faithful. God of That's why he predicted you because you actually predicted. So many people advice, please go and use the church premises for your reception because um, you don't have money to so know. Please start at being my hands to be part of also, we have other group, people, other groups, uh, 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 where we shall actually, uh, uh, you know, when you saw, stood by with us, stood by uh, with us when, uh, because of preparation. Plenty of that, I don't want to be mentioning it. Yeah. So we have plenty of them that actually stood by us uh, because of our preparation. And everything we do is for us. Sir, what advice do you have for other young guys that are of the age of getting married but that's the age of marriage are coming? financial constraint, you've passed through it, you've been through it, so what do you have to say, what advice do you have for us out there? So as my wife has earlier said, as she has earlier said, that um, she saw the hard working in me, the potential, the potential. Are you saying that women see the future of the man, woman, the man, is it true? It's like that the bread is not far from the truth. She actually saw how hard working I am. And the kind of when I met her first, I told her I, I have not come to play. I told her some of our ambitions. I told her some of our things. I I want to push in life. And I am finally like, are you ready to follow me? And she told me she was even suggesting that was when I was relaxed and you know, 
So I want to advise the people out there that no matter what you have the time now and all, all the best you want to your spouse you want to get married to, no matter what the person has or the person does not have, once you have that inner peace and conviction that even though the person may not have to be that tomorrow the person is going to have, I want to want you to go ahead. Once you have the inner peace, that is one of the test of marriage. Because I think once I went, when I got married to her, we are staying in my kitchen currently now. It's almost the same size with the house. The room you yeah, your apartment. That I was when I got married to her. And I have other two siblings staying in us. That's in you know, the people one matras, it's only one matter that can interview me. The rest of it are just on the floor then the life of it. If one person is dressing the rest will be out. But as I got married to her, as the Bible has earlier said that in that man is a I think mysteriously the landlord came and drove me out of the house that he doesn't want any money person to be in his house. That was how we stranded and went to that house where they're keeping portraits. So we, we, we stayed there for like we just begged, we just keep going to the properties. But this happened after and just two weeks after marriage. Wow. So yeah, the going you're supposed to be enjoying your honeymoon if you're already stranded. Yeah, stranded. So the two was went around the bottom of the apartment. Just spend one month there. If they are there, the person on those passions will have to go. But I still need to ask something. I need before we came to where we are currently. And um, all this happened within one month. God showed us some niceness within one month. Not just that, our business environment changed drastically since, I, since we got married. When I got married, I started with one branch. But since I got my daughter to this particular year, 2022, one one branch is adding to our branch. Like every year, one branch, every year, one branch, every year, one branch. But I'm talking to you, we have spent three years in marriage and we have four branches. Wow. Just three years married, four branches. So I want to believe that we are actually next to Wow, what I've heard of other young ladies that are like you out there, especially that are in school, or those that are in your position, the guy they want to get married to not and actually go young yet, and their family are not in support of their dream. What advice do you have for them? They are out there listening to you. Say, if they have the personal conviction like what you said, or what you had, conviction you had. And the conviction me I had. Very convincing. Yeah. There was no doubt because I think even in while in school, I was a bit okay than him. Because there was a day I think. Of course, you were yeah, you were giving him first stuff and all. I was managing your business. That period said yeah. he was not having money or food stuff, so he left for school. I think to see his supervisor. He slept that day without eating. So I went to the house. I had a kid with me. I went to his house and I cooked. I thanked myself. I prepared, uh, I think, rice and stew then for him. Just put love to him and went back to school. So when he came back, I just saw rice and stew. Just proceeded out of the food. He was very happy that time. I think while he was school, I was the one that was able to. God helping me to sustain him that day. So money should not be the paramount thing we look out for. Money should not be oh. yeah, it's what is the place of God in your marriage in your home? It's in your the both of you can answer for us. Okay. Um just as I've said, I think I find the wife and the All this thing we have I've explained to you. It's not man that did it is God. And if you are not for you say if you are not Bible say if you are not for me, then you are against me. I want to believe that it's because we are for him. That is why since we got married, we've never had better yesterday. God has been faithful. We we don't want to have a more complex act than this one. That is why we're 
There are plenty of things to worry about. Dash cars, chicken, mattresses, bed, and gas cooker. There is no space to accommodate it. We just want to live a very simple life. That is why we are still living here. It's less than the money that we spend apartment that is not even for my kitchen now. Yeah. There's no chair. If, if it's only one what, what, what a transformation. If it's only it's not even normal bed. This student's bed. This spring. This spring that we're using. The you know what you do? Why you're eating is cool. Why should rent your marriage? Yes. <laughs> I gave you. Oh my god. That's why it's cool. I gave it to you wow. That is what we are using. In just two thousand and wow. nine. How has it been then and now? We can't we can't compare. Oh my god. Well in conclusion, I can't thank you enough and we hope to have you again and again. And I believe the viewers out there have learned so much from your stories. Uh, it's left for you now to learn from their mistakes and whatever you need to pick, pick from them too. Continue to watch Abraham's Bosom show and like our page, subscribe, follow us and uh, view our... Press the subscriber button to get updates from this channel. God bless you.